alaikum and welcome to Flash in a Pan. Today I'm gonna make you some super quick and super easy creamy chicken with mushroom. Look at that, lovely and delicious. So join me. Assalamualaikum everybody and welcome to Flash in a Pan and today we're going to make you some creamy chicken with mushroom and that is going to be yummy so let's have a look so we've got some chicken chicken breast we get the knife to cut it just take one piece and cut it in cubes medium sized just like that very simple chicken is very easy to cut and let's put the hub on. Okay, here it is. And put some oil in that to fry our chicken. Not too much. Doesn't need to be too much. We're just gonna cook it quickly. And there we go. Just chuck it all in, put this away. You have to wash it because we're going to be using it to cut the mushroom. So here we are, washed and ready to use. And let's have a look at the chicken here. I'm going to add some salt to it and stuff very soon. I'm just going to cover it a bit because it cooks better once covered. And let's get the mushrooms, which are over here just like get maybe like five mushrooms or so just slice them nice and big but thin so keep the same size of the mushroom just slice through it the last bit one two and three pieces there we go it's nice and lovely so Let's go back to the chicken and see what it needs. Here it is, frying nicely. Get this. Mix it up a bit, just like that. Turn it over. Make sure it's cooking from all sides. And now, let's season it. There. I'm going to use a little bit of cumin in this. called maybe like half a teaspoon in it and a tiny bit of turmeric not much stuff because I don't want it to be spicy the turmeric is simply for the color because we're gonna be adding other stuff there that don't require much spices there we're gonna mix it up together Give it that nice, lovely yellow colour. Just add some salt. Now, oh, isn't that cute? Look at that tiny mini spoon. That's <laughs> just the cutest. Two and three. I could just keep on going like that forever, just because it's so sweet. But I'm gonna stop. <laughs> Don't want it to be too salty. There. Mix it together a bit more. Make sure it's cooked from all sides. There we go. I'm gonna cover it a bit. To cook properly. Last thing we want is undercooked chicken. Don't want that. Gonna put that back. Prepare the garlic. but not add it yet. Just gonna keep it aside. There we go. Lovely big pieces. And that last bit is so stubborn, it's not coming off. There we go, let's clean up a bit. Not to have mess on our working area. 
There we go. Nice and lovely. It's back to the chicken. Mm, looks great. Look at that. Look at that lovely yellow colour. Can you see that? Looks great. That's how we want it. Good, so I'm going to increase the heat a tiny bit, just a tiny bit. Can you hear it sizzling? There you go, it needs a little bit longer on the hob. Chicken breast cooks pretty quick. The only thing is that we don't want it to be dry from the inside. We want it to, st to still stay juicy because it's not going to be nice if it's dry, even though, even if you put sauce in it. Still, you need to have each piece of those chickens to be nice and juicy. Which is why we're covering it with the lid. So, let's see. All right, let's get to the other ingredients, main ingredients. And they are the cream, double cream. I'm using here about, let's say, a quarter of a cup and some cream cheese. I'm using one with chives, with herbs. You can get it from any store, just get some cream cheese. It smells good. I can just eat it like that, actually, but I'm not going to do that because the producer will not be happy. So we need another pack. <laughs> okay, here we go. Let's have a look. There's nice. We can add the mushroom. Let's put this aside for a second. Just to fry it quickly on a very high heat with the chicken. Just a tiny bit. And it's looking good. Not too much down again and then go back and get our cream and cheese yay and the spoon <laughs> so you're gonna pour that cream mm, that looks lovely there put this away get the cream cheese and put that into just one spoon two and a third there we go. I think we put that away too. This we will need very soon. Garlic crusher. So just gonna mix this a bit together. Okay, add a little bit, increase the heat. There we are. Now I like it to be a little bit more yellowy, so I think I'm gonna add a bit more turmeric. I'm going to add a bit more turmeric to that. Just a sprinkle. Like this. Oh, I shouldn't have done it with my fingers because now my nails are going to be stained yellow. <laughs> it will match with my scarf at least. There we are. Mix it together. Nice, that's the yellow I want. Good. Now, getting lower the heat a tiny bit. Let it simmer just for a bit. And look at this thing. Lovely basil. It's so fragrant, it's so strong. It makes a whole room smell nice. It smells lemony a bit. Isn't that just lovely? So you're going to need just a little bit, or if you like it to be stronger flavour, add a bit more than just a little bit. I like it strong. So, you're going to chop that, not too small, just like medium sized uh, uh, pieces. Just like that, because I like that swimming in our sauce. It's going to look nice at the end. And get those garlic pieces here. and crush them right inside. There we go. I'm gonna turn it off for a bit, just a tiny bit, because I don't want it to dry up. 
going to mix it together like that. I'll need a little bit of lemon to give it a bit of soury taste. Mm, look at this, nice and fresh. I'm going to stab this just a tiny bit here to get the juices out and squeeze that whole half lemon in our sauce. It looks nice already. Hmm, that's nice. Let's add our basil. Now look at that. It smells good. And add it just like that. That's it. Creamy mushroom, nice and ready. Now let's serve. So let's clean up. Put these things away. Okay, and put our plate right here in the middle. Get our sauce. And look at this. Isn't that lovely? Trust me, it tastes really good. I'm gonna put it like that. Serve it with rice. You can even have it with the spaghetti or pasta. It goes with anything really. And it is lovely with that basil leaves. There we go. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna sprinkle a little bit of chili flakes on top. There they are, my chili flakes. Just a tiny bit. Look at this. It smells delicious. Trust me, it will be delicious. And just for presentation, I'm just gonna put a little bit, just a few leaves of basil on the side to give it that nice look. So put on those basil leaves to give it that nice look. And there you go, the creamy chicken with mushroom. Enjoy. Mm -hmm.